So I don't really know what to do right now, but I'm gonna make a theme team review over going over what I my th theme team has featured on it. So quarterback Mike Vick with pass lead, elite, and gunslinger, and then we have the new Bettis card with backfield master, bruiser for zero, and one AP tank. He's fumbled once, and that was just the first ever drive that I had him on, like one of the first ever snaps. But other than that. He has, he's been very, very good for me. So then we go to the line. The line's terrible, but we got a, we got Fanica and he's a good guard, but I put him at tackle since he gets Matador for zero and safe secure protector for one, because obviously I can't have secure protector because my line doesn't, is not high enough overall. So then we go over to Fryermuth. He is terrible, but he's, he's, a, he's good enough. Um, so then we go Plaxico, Juju, and Deontay. Juju, he seems to be very good, but he has not played well. He has not played that good for me, but he has wide receiver punts and deep out. Plaxico Burris has short in for one and then deep out for two. And then Deontay Johnson has run off elite. And then George Pickens has honorary linemen. And that's it. So then moving over to defense, we have Minka Fitzpatrick. For, with pick artist, Rod Woodson pick artist, Levi Wallace pick artist, Mike Hilton pick artist, Troy Palomalu pick artist. If you're wondering why I have no zone KOs or man KOs, I play on current gen or last gen, whatever you want to call it. But I'm, I am on PS5, but I don't want to buy the other next gen version. It is a waste of money, in my opinion, because... It's just way too ability based and at least in this you have some fun with just like only pick artists because KOs don't seem to work. So um inside stuff on Hargrave and Mean Joe, two best defensive tackles in the game and the Steelers theme team is lucky to have them. Hoping for Cam Hayward team of the year. Ogan Joby, maybe we'll get like a heavyweights wild card Wednesday or whatever. Yep, uh, and then Kevin Green with Lurker and Edge Threat Elite, and then Highsmith with Demoralizer, Melvin Ingram with Speedster, TJ Watt with the with Deflator. But the best players on my team would have to be Minka Fitzpatrick because he never gets mossed. He's always picks the ball off. And then Troy, I have him in the box. Mike Hilton gets mossed a lot. Um, I'm seeing Hargrave actually do more than me and Joe right now, but I don't really know what's the deal. But yeah, and then for my offense, my best player has to be Jerome Bettis, second best. I'd have to give it to Plaxico or probably Fanica. I I probably wouldn't give it to a lineman, but because you know I don't use our lineman. Yeah, but that's going over the Steelers theme team. We need some upgrades at corner. Maybe middle linebacker Devin Bush. If we go to his abilities, he's I think 94 speed. Yeah, I see 94 speed. Um, zone coverage 91, 94 hit power, 511, which is short, but he does have his jumping 94. So 94 change of direction. That's mainly what you need from a middle linebacker. But yeah, he seems to be a good card every year, even though he stinks. But yeah. Pretty much the D line has been good every year for the Steelers team. So, yeah, and that's going over my team. Here's my strat items: Steelers one, and then Bull Rushers gives four power move, two finesse move. It's pretty much because I want my guys to get 99, unless there's one that gives like everybody plus one, then I'll get that. But and then this because I don't really need another throw power. And then we have Commander's playbook. Um, running back, blah, 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 whatever, whatever. And then special teams, drawn by the side returner because he's fast. And he has tanks, so he maybe could take one to the house. I just put him in there. Um, and then I play squads with my friends, so that's why I have Rod Woodson and Troy Palmolo. Because if you put them in special teams, either at punt returner or kick returner, you can put, like, defensive backs or safeties there. So then you're able to sub them in if you're on defense. Yeah. And then just, you know, the regular, we haven't had any upgrades, but I don't expect any upgrades because these guys were both mid this year. So, yeah, that's my theme team, guys. I mean, it wasn't anything to enjoy, but see you next time.